okay so check this out right every time you search google stadia this guy a video pops up trying out google stadia two years later so it happened four months ago it has 313,000 views and, then, and you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and check them out because i've never watched it well it's been more than two years since 313,000 views been almost a year since google announced that they were going to be closing down any of their internal studios that they had formed in order to make games for the platform i think it was around that time that i really checked out of stadia and just <laughs> hold on hold on, hold on. <laughs> look at this right here top 10 reasons why google stadia failed i guess it failed guys i guess it failed hope you guys uh got your money back from google because I hadn't really been looking at it much at all but it's still around. In fact, they've been updating Google Stadia for a while now. <laughs> He's got a PlayStation uh, shirt on. <laughs> That's funny. Dude. Now, and I thought we would jump back in and see the what box exactly is brand new. They've done here. So if you guys enjoy this video, make sure that like button helps out a ton. And if you're new here to the Spawn Wave channel, make sure you subscribe down below. So I do have this Google Stadia Premiere Edition that I ordered a while ago when they were doing like the free Google Stadia boxes. If you remember. At one, they don't they weren't doing free stadium box one point it popped up i saw wario 64 tweeted out and what it was it was if you were a member for youtube premium with google which i am oh okay you would that be able was to free. just get yeah. one of these sent okay. out to you that's I, true I went, they did they did they did give away free versions for youtube very premium and this showed up like a week later and i've kind of been holding on to it ever since i was actually trying to figure out what i was going to do with it and you know what it, it makes sense to just use this here with the control since i used google stadia i'm on the browser now but i do have to sync up the state launched it was super bare bones you couldn't even buy games through the browser you had to use the phone app to buy a game yeah and that then was you could go to your browser and play it there or through the chromecast and all of this it was very strange i think when it launched it was certainly a knee-jerk reaction from google because they wanted to beat things like Luna and even Xbox with X Cloud at the time to market. And look up there. Who, we um, who came free first? Games. There's on sale new releases, Stadia Pro games. There's actually a lot here for Pro games. It says see all. Wow, okay. Control Ultimate Edition, Bloodstained, Moonlighter, Blue Fire, Trails of Cold Steel 3. These are all games that are part of the Pro membership that I can just play. Ease 8. It's pretty good. Dirt 5, of course, went over Terraria. Shantae, Risky's Revenge. Destroy All Humans. Was Shantae that popular? Uh, I mean, I played it. It's kind of hard for me, but uh, I, didn't even, I didn't know it was that famous. Needed, and then you can also just connect to software. So I guess like OBS or something there. So what should we claim? Let's You know what? Let's claim Darksiders 3. I feel like that's a, a game that I'll be able to feel any kind of input latency because I wonder if he we'll if he signed up, up to pro. Jump in. Okay, in this so video. we're into the game now, and I'll admit, it's not as like laggy as I would expect like a streaming service to be. Certainly not how it used to be way back in the day with like Gaikai or On Live. It's gotten better as you expect with technology. I think the biggest problem I've had with Stadia is that they didn't really know what they wanted to be. And they still kind of don't necessarily, although I think they've sort of found their way to a certain destination with it. Originally, it's out. Oh, and the they casual say, hey, players, there, probably. There are some pretty serious issues when it comes okay. on here. You don't need any kind of account. So, uh, you know, it's uh, when you're dealing with the real game, like uh, hardcore gamers, um, I think a lot of them are going to have issues because it's not perfect. It's not perfect. I'm in Hawaii, and I can say that. Um, so that's one of those things where...